was about to say a super intelligent orc named Elon Tusk, but then I remembered Elon Tusk is already a thing. Oof. Oof. <laughs> he owns Quitter, a message board for people with no job. Wow. In the middle of Glotnia. Keeps trying to pedal his electric powered boats. <laughs> Literally pedaling them around the bay. <laughs> so Samson's feeling melancholy about his Borco gun. And Kiala woke up after a 30 minute nap. Now what? So you think it can be fixed? Hmm, maybe. Seems kind of a spell that fixes things. Yeah. You think mending would be able to repair the gun? Yeah. Hmm. Most likely. Oh. Mm. Um. Let Nim take a look at it. See what I can do. That's yeah. what the rely on people's for, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, y'all. I was thinking about that spell from yesterday. Um. You know, all the things that we were talking about. We talk about a lot of things. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I think I have an, uh, some idea. about how I feel about things. Hmm. It's weird. <laughs> Is that your feeling? Feeling weird? <laughs> Not no. Ah. Feeling weird or weirdly feeling? I think the biggest thing is that I don't know how I may or may not have felt about friends and what, what if anything he may have felt back. All I know is right now I just sort of feel betrayed and sad and over everything that happened. And I don't want to not think about everything that happened, even if it wasn't at the best time or under the best circumstances. You know what I mean? I suppose so. Oh, at least they're making some sense. What do you want to do about it? I think I just want to move on.
that's the right thing to do, right? Just sort of not let things hold you back. Think. Feels like there's a lot of things I've just had to come to terms with like that on this trip. I feel like that's no different. You know what I mean? I do. And... On that note... Ellen? Mm hmm I think I love you. And then Hel falls off the building. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> well, now I'm awake. <laughs> How dare you start falling asleep? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a great time to be making spaghetti. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> And on that note, we'll see you next week, okay? <laughs> no. Wait, we have four minutes, don't you fucking dare. Oh, we, we got a whole extra hour! Ending. <laughs> 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 Alright, go on, we got a whole extra hour, we said we were gonna go an extra hour. Well, y'all is falling off the building. <laughs> yeah, okay, fine. I gotta roll a new character first. <laughs> Alright, hold on, let me go get the Damn, character Damn, why does this always happen? <laughs> okay, uh... Shot her with a characters... Well, I don't believe the ball's in my court at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I hit the wrong button. There you go. <laughs> I, I gave you another character sheet, Jade. You can What's start re-rolling. Alright. <laughs> cool. New <laughs> nice. Hello, I am New Hyala. Race, now. not Tabaxi. Background, not Hyala. <laughs> hit points, a different amount than Hyala had. Oh, you can actually uh, type that in there. Oh no, it didn't take it. Damn. All you have to do is put more than one if Yala falls off the building and died. <laughs> True! <laughs> <laughs> I, I gave her the appropriate alignment. Nice. We have not Tabaxi, not Yala, not Yala's for her thing. Personality trait. Talkative. Alive. That just sounds Alive. like Nim if Nim tried to do Kiala while drunk. I really hope that we come across a changeling stand-up comedian who just does different impressions. <laughs> <laughs> then Nim hits you with, that's my cousin Frederick! We don't talk about Frederick. Don't talk I like that friends, the hooded right? mask, if you drop it right on top of Yala, kind of just fits. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'll oh, find- should become Moon Knight! I I'll think <laughs> you'll find that new Yala has some pretty good stats. What? Except her charisma. Her charisma's not very good. <laughs> and her like orca hit points. Girl has ten hit points. <laughs> All right, let's... Oh, that's not like. Oh my God, Nim finally has more hit points than somebody. <laughs> uh, yeah, Prin. <laughs> Her movement also went down. Nah, not I think Prin yeah. still had more hit points than Nim does. Yeah, but not currently. <laughs> so, what's Kala's response? Is it actually falling off? And does Samson just let that happen? Because if so, Samson sucks. <laughs> No, if Yala falls off, Samson's going to catch her. 
Or try to. <laughs> Damn, your Hyala's still alive. Uh, Hyala's still alive. Okay, goodbye. Well, but you, Hyala's still alive. Oh no, I deleted her. She's being caught. <laughs> She's just gonna, like, look at him for a minute, and be like, You... you mean... like... Like what we... talked about? Last... Mm -hmm. evening? But you're gay. <laughs> Mary Maker, you know I'm not a man, right? <laughs> oh, that'd be so funny if she was to say you're not? <laughs> <laughs> It'd be so funny if she just said, I, I'm a woman. I gave birth. No, it's like the, it's like the opposite of the end of that movie. She's like, I'm a woman. And he's like, well, nobody's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what movie it is. You don't? Oh my gosh, we have to watch it. It's so funny. It's a, what's this? Some Like It Hot. That's what it's called. It's can really I, funny. Can I watch it with you? No. If we ever actually end up watching it. All right, we're now up to a quintuple feature. <laughs> All right, we're getting sidebar, uh, confessionals, and blue screens. That is the point. Go. <laughs> Li literally buying time. <laughs> no, not buying time. Only raw emotion. Uh, yeah, Hella looks kind of poofy. Like, what? Uh, uh, are you sure? Uh. And she, she's gonna like shake her head after saying that and be like, "Sorry, that's the dumb question." But no, it's fine. I ask them all the time. <laughs> it's also a very valid question given the conversation yesterday. <laughs> um, I mean. Ah, I see. I'm Prince Rebound. If, if, <laughs> if I look at it the way that, you know, you were talking about, someone you always want to be around, when, when they're not there, you want nothing more than for them to be back. Jealous of. Uh, what'd you say yesterday? <laughs> That's not the point. <laughs> I. Well, I was going through my head yesterday, and I don't remember everything you said, but I knew one thing. And. What you said. Felt like how I feel about you. She's just kind of like blue screening, all poofy. And then she starts to tip over forward. <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, <laughs> gra gra like, grabs her, places her back, and goes, Wee! <laughs> <laughs> Part of me wants to ask if I can roll for sneak attack damage. Uh, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> or you just have to give Samson the uh, mechanics for the smile attack and the emotional damage. Emotional damage. Emotional damage! I can't say for certain I know when I start to feel this way, but I don't know, it's just 
we gotten so close over these past few months and it feels like well whenever you're around there are no dark clouds no. there are no mixed one I don't have to be scared of things that might happen later or, or be upset about the things I think I can and can't do. You said that before I could unmute my mic, Jade. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Frankly, as far as things stand, I trust that my mom will get help, and I trust that should something go wrong, that you, me, and Nim can handle it, everything will be okay. But the only thing that really scares me is just the idea that after all of this, just never seeing you again. And I guess that sounds a little silly, but am, am I talking too much? <laughs> Trust me, talk more. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? Are you a flying spaghetti monster? Jesus. I mean, she did say she was making spaghetti. Yeah, that was the joke. True. Mm. I don't really know where to go from here. He's gonna, like, sort of, like, scratch the back of his head and look away. Are you okay with this? <laughs> She's still, like, slightly petrified. And then she pushes him off the roof. Wee! <laughs> Just bats him I didn't cat. know you were a tsundere! <laughs> Just bats him across the face like a cat. Bat. Yeah. Nickel punch! <laughs> Yeah. Eventually, she manages to get out. Do you need to roll um, another d30? Um, uh, no. Uh, <laughs> I can't. Would Samson actually sit there for 30 minutes? <laughs> yes. Do anything? Damn. The answer is yes. Just feeling worse and Bruh. worse every minute that passes. Yeah, no, it'd probably be at the point where, like, his legs are just psychosomatically fell asleep and he couldn't leave if he wanted to. <laughs> the only way out is to misty step off the building. <laughs> Sam, the longer it goes, Samson will get more and more tensed up until if he ever does relax, he just actually does fall off the edge. <laughs> it's like, I haven't exhaled in 30 minutes, Yala. Say something. I didn't know I could hold them my breath this long. Yeah, no, it doesn't Monday. take that long. <laughs> She's just like, uh, I, um, and then kind of like rubs at her chin with her hand.
longest wait. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, I was actively roleplaying the whole 30 minutes. <laughs> ah, it's good. Real time roleplay. <laughs> Gee. Well, so all I was gonna say is the longest wait in the West. Woo! <laughs> A waterfall of tumbleweeds comes by. And you're really serious about all of this? Uh, Kella actually chiming up, uh, kind of jump scares him a bit. <laughs> and he'll just like, sort of like, tense up and nod. I see. Well... I suppose... I have... found myself rather fond of you as well. Uh, I'm not oh. sure that... Now is the time for this discussion, and I haven't really had a discussion like this before. There's something different about you. Making eye contact, but he's just sort of like he's very much hanging on to just about every word. <laughs> <laughs> so are the rest of us, Samson. So are the rest of us. Yes, the words, the things Kiel is great at doing. Right, those words. <laughs> right. I roll Whoa. intimidation. <laughs> from what I've come to learn. Um, so, if you want to try and say things a different way, uh, mm. I, I don't know what else to have Samson say besides just give like a thumbs up. <laughs> Because <laughs> my immediate response was like, you do, you champ. <laughs> I feel like I'm fucking rock climbing with the amount of words I'm hanging off of. A literal cliffhangers. She she looks at the thumbs up. And, and then back at him. And then back at the thumbs up. And then back at him. Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> and she's just like He's also giving like a, a smile like a little questioning smile of like uh, <laughs> Am I supporting right? I, I really feel like he's just standing there with a gap toothed smile just 
making the lowest, the very least audible, like, <laughs> sound. If Samson, if Zanzibar thought he was screaming before. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Samson, I wanted to ask you. Ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! What is going on? <laughs> Feeling Zanzibar. Kill, Kill's just gonna be like, are you saying it's okay to kiss you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I missed something. How much water do I have left? <laughs> just enough to spit out dramatically. <laughs> but not enough to drown myself in. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit really do happen when Nim goes to bed. <laughs> yeah, it really does, every single time. <laughs> you choose to go to bed! <laughs> Nim was not getting on the roof. <laughs> we left the rope down. Yeah. Nim you, was never gonna get on the roof. You could we left the stay <laughs> awake! Uh, oh, so, so, like, so, yes, yeah, so what would... <laughs> Jealous is that Samson's gonna like squeak like a deer in headlights? <laughs> I don't like, know if deer squeak in headlights. How would you know? <laughs> how many <laughs> deers have you hit? hit? How many deers have you hit? Uh, not enough to hear them because I'm usually in my car. Also, none. <laughs> you can't prove that. Shut up. <laughs> also, they tend to just scream awkwardly. Don't ask why I know that. Point is that. I've hit no deer, but I have hit something. I. It was a child. Okay, so one one time late at night, I did accidentally clip um one of two raccoons that were crossing the street as I turned, and I fucking got out of my car. <laughs> and by the time I did, like I saw two little blobs scurry away, and I'm like, oh thank fucking god. But I was petrified. Oof. L oof. I had a I had a friend once who, um, because we lived in a in a on campus apartment that had some like local cats that stayed around. We were coming home from a walk one night, and she goes up to what she thinks is a cat, and starts going like, "Here, kitty, kitty," and then like I'm walking ahead slightly, and I just hear ah. <laughs> And she comes running up from behind like it was a raccoon! <laughs> Here, kitty! Raccoon. Chuck's Panda Stories aside, quote, Is it okay to kiss you? Go! Uh, and Samson- yeah, so Samson- <laughs> Go! I feel like gun-shy is the best description for how he is right now. And he's just going to, like, uh, eke out, like, um, of course, if, if that's what you want to do, um, what do I do? <laughs> do whatever you're comfortable doing. Why am I only imagining oh. Simpson doing really stupid, goofy things right now? Uh, okay. Just give me And then, uh, he'll just sort of... I... Sit there! And... Yeah. Sit there. <laughs> no, she'll 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 lay down and give him a very small kiss. Small kiss. Kiss obtained. The only thing that makes me especially sad right now is I was gonna have Snowdrop like kind of pop behind you guys, but he can't teleport that far. Get oh. owned, the rat. <laughs> so Samson. If mine is a rat, yours is a sewer rat. <laughs> <laughs> if that shit was in my sewers, I would <laughs> scream and It is a rodent of unusual size. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
what the fuck does that make, make Mr. Golem? A Floridian sewer gator? No, he's a polite gentleman thing. That's what happens when you don't change your cat's litter. <laughs> oh, that's gross. Yeah. No. Yep. He's <laughs> not yes. even litter. He's sand. He's what you bring back from the beach. <laughs> Unintentionally and in the box. <laughs> anyway, 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 wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Good lord. We hit that God, forward. You, you sound you like you're invested or something. <laughs> Shut up! Bombshells are being dropped. Of course, I'm fucking invested. Small kiss obtained. Now go. Like I assume on the cheek. Uh no. no. <laughs> oh. What do you assume on the cheek? I assume it's on the no, cheek. Wait. Yeah, no, I know you don't have a lot of experience with this, but uh, bro, no, like usually those are. Last second. Yeah, usually those are on the lips, and Jesus I was Christ. gonna say, it would be so funny if he gave her a kiss on the forehead. You know, like, if he, if he moves in some way last second, then yes, it will be somewhere else, but, like... Uh, I guess he will... Stay still? Reciprocate? <laughs> God damn. Really showing your inexperience, Jesus. <laughs> I love you, Ed Macaulay. Fuck. <laughs> it's not supposed to sound like a question. Yeah, no, it's it's, it's not funny. long. She kind of just like does it and sits all the way back. Like, wow. Because she has no idea, not... like, what he's comfortable with on account of the fact that he learned he about. Also, has no idea. Night. <laughs> She's dealing with a virgin supreme. Yeah. He's still got the fucking yogurt cup foil wrapping on top of him. He's shelf stable. I don't know where I was going with that analogy. Let's just forget it. Anyway, she leans back. And Nimbus asleep. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Uh, I guess he'll reach out for her hand, and he'll, he'll reciprocate with a small kiss of his own. Woo! I think that urge to have him ask how what he like how how do he do? <laughs> thumbs up, thumbs down. <laughs> On a scale from thumbs up to thumbs down. <laughs> Don't worry, Jake. I sent Revel the same message. <laughs> what message? Share with the class. Why am I being <laughs> left out? Share. Why are you leaving me out? Are we not friends? The message is meant for the two that did the action and does not convey the same over tech. <laughs> we haven't done that action yet. Yeah, the I- The fuck was this yeah. message? <laughs> <laughs> she just said she was proud of us. Yeah. I've heard speed running before. I've heard shipping. I've never heard speed shipping. What is this, Shay? What? Ignore it. Go to bed. I've been trying for 72 hours, but that's irrelevant. But anyway, can... uh, why did I take a drink of water? <laughs> we all make mistakes. <laughs> so... What now? Um. I guess... Whatever he'd like. Um. Perhaps... It's best to keep... Thinking on things for some time. Before... 
doing anything else. Oh. Uh. Yeah. That, that sound. That, that, that sounds smart. And you want to stay up here a little longer? Sure. And she'll she'll move the hand that he's holding so that she can hold it back. And give it kind of a squeeze. He'll sort of squeeze back and I guess uh, he'll just sort of lean over. Oh, onto her shoulder. Wait, so I can go look at you dorks from behind you guys. <laughs> I'm well, so like floating two inches above the surface and just like <laughs> with her arms folded like I see you. I see, like see the problem, like that gives me like that gives me like Frieza vibes. <laughs> 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 Looking down. Oh God, Nim, Nim is Frieza. <laughs> Nim gets a tail. Oh yeah, imagine that. <laughs> yeah, and then but Nim it, gets called Simpson. <laughs> I can't so stay in bed. No, Frieza calls everybody something else. Oh, Christ. A monkey. Yep. You damn filthy monkey! How dare you, you cut off my tail! So, yeah. Uh, I hated that episode. But anyway, you guys go on. Continue. Yeah, they'll just stay like that for a bit. Die you soon. Yeah. So they die. Y'all is like, I am awake, right? <laughs> On the inside. <laughs> she's not saying that out loud, but she's just like, I'm confused. <laughs> oh. Oh, the itch. The absolute spiritual desire to just have Zanzibar pipe and go, oh yeah, you're awake. <laughs> just leave her like that. <laughs> that would kill oh, everyone. That would make this a traumatic memory for her. <laughs> <laughs> I won't, I swear, but oh, the temptation! Why isn't it just a thing with DMs? It's gotta be with all DMs, right? The temptation to just destroy things? No. Don't, don't call me out like this, bro. Oof. Come on, you called yourself out. No. <laughs> you denied axolotls, you've destroyed hopes and dreams. You say that, and then let there be axolotls. <laughs> Wait, you've approved the axolotls? All right, I'm gonna send a DM right now. Hold on. Uh oh. To oh, who? where are you sending a dungeon, a dungeon master? <laughs> We're sending you to the shadow room. Hoggers. <laughs> I'm not allowed to be a player ever again. <laughs> You're in the cotton candy room now. <laughs> Anyways, uh, once Yala convinces herself that this is reality, she'll, uh... <laughs> Regardless of whether or not it is. Whether or not it is. <laughs> she'll, uh, she'll turn her head to give him, like, a kiss on the top of the head. I feel like you can feel him heating up, despite the fact he has an ice stone. <laughs> <laughs> he becomes marginally warmer. Wow. It's plenty hot out already. Cut that out. Okay. <laughs> Take the hot second ice stone puts it on. <laughs> <laughs> it freezes to death. What do you mean yellow's there? Freezes to life. Ooh, there you go. <laughs> to be the peanut gallery but now i'm just imagining the katma arc yala gets nim all dressed up and then she gets samson double dressed up and he ends up looking like maggie simpson <laughs> in the star suit we need to make sure you're extra warm Boop. yala i can't stand help yeah i'm star shit 
I have I have found a way of locomotion as Samson does cartwheels up the mountain. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we just invented the wheel. There were so many <laughs> wheels! I know. <laughs> Funny. The first wheel was Samson. <laughs> they say that the first wheel was a nomad from Varesis. No one knows how he did it. Scholars and perpetual motion scientists believe that it was due to a unimaginable amount of luck and bad luck kept in perfect equilibrium <laughs> all right now what oh oh my god and then when she wakes up unless they never tell her she has to learn by context which means she'll never learn. <laughs> Dang. I mean, it's 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 like word of Nim's creator that Nim does not understand <laughs> context and subtleties very well. <laughs> Most of the time, Nim gets a couple. I just refuse to elaborate. Which? Ooh. Oh my God! She fixed this whole time that Yala is just being kind to Samson because he told her about his honeymoon because she found out about his honeymoon with Prin and she figures Samson's been grieving for years doesn't even notice that they have like kids and shit together I'm sorry I'm too easily side tangents by these new developments too many memes flowing through my head Continue. so let's go until midnight I'm kidding <laughs> We can't go and- oh, we'd have to stop at midnight, I have to go get my dad, but then we could continue. <laughs> no. I'm good with stopping at 11. So what are the lovebirds doing? I don't see any birds. It's right there, you bastard. Uh, yeah, but he's not I dating her. Their characters are dating. <laughs> hmm. I mean, I guess eventually the sun goes down. <laughs> yeah. Or, or eventually, Kella might be like. Should we go down and work on the tree? I'm so glad oh. I didn't say that sentence. Oh, look at you working on wood together. Yeah, mm. uh, swing and a miss. Hopefully it's not too hard a task. Just glad it didn't come out of my mouth. Uh, strike two! <laughs> Still glad it's not coming you out You already of almost kicked me out of the server on accident. Might as well give you a reason to do it on purpose. <laughs> She's I got see. a point hey, there! You. She hit a whole run! <laughs> <laughs> but, but, yeah, at, uh, at Hila's suggestion, Samson will be like, uh, yeah. I'm not, uh, I need to sleep. I guess we'll have to set up some more torches. What time is it about? Um, I guess if we were going to like around the time sunset, that'd probably be around like seven, maybe. Yeah. Considering it's uh, late summer. Samson will, uh, he'll get up and, uh, he'll offer Kala his hand to get up as well. 
She'll puff a bit and then take it. And they'll help her up? Oh! Should we take the rope down? Apparently, there's a way to get up here without climbing. Uh. The climb's not so bad, though. True, but... We don't need it, and I guess no one else does either. I suppose. I'll... I'll take the rope down. Where the fuck Samson is... Samson takes the rope down. Where the Ooh. fuck is the effect for Charmed? <laughs> um... Plus you. <laughs> and then he'll, uh... He'll, uh... Climb down. Wait, is the window still open? <laughs> As you climb down the rope... You notice that the window is closed. He locked oh. you out! <laughs> <laughs> so do we, like, get to the window and then are like, uh... <laughs> uh okay, uh... You just knock on the thing! <laughs> tap, tap, tap. <laughs> yeah. It's a sloped window. I don't even know if his arm would be able to reach that far. Kelly uses her tail. <laughs> just like... <laughs> I, I can only imagine what Zanzibar, like, he's just, like, flipping through a book or something. He looks up and he sees a poofy Hyala and a beat Red Samson. What <laughs> 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 dorks. Uh, should I make it a roll to grab his attention? I mean, I mean if you're knocking on the window, uh, unless you want to use Mental Mind Link. You know, that's a better idea than what I thought. <laughs> what are you doing? Because I was about to say, well, Simpson still has a working gun. <laughs> Alright, so what do the lovebirds do? Can we, can we, like, I guess swing until, like, we can land on the window? <laughs> Remember, it, it sloped away from you. Yes, but I mean, this is at least fifty feet, which means if it's, we still should have probably have like a good twenty feet of rope from like the uh, top of a uh, like the roof. You know what I mean? Are you trying to Tarzan into the window? <laughs> That That is what I did mean by swinging. So you want to use yourself like a bell clapper and smash into the window. Not hard, but enough to go dink. Okay. Well, was there a role you were suggesting for turning yourselves into a human bell clapper? No. Because you said neither none of us could reach, and I don't know if Hella's tail would be able to. Whoop, who who died? died? Who did die? She died. Oh no! Her computer! The conversation was too spicy! No, it wasn't. I. <laughs> yeah, Shay, that's the joke. It was British spicy. <laughs> you know? So I really don't care I... either way. I just want to understand the choice. Why not just say, hey, can you open the window up? Oh. Yeah, that's a better idea. I, I did say that, and you did agree to that, and then you started talking about swinging into the window. Because they're both screaming internally, probably. Their brains aren't. That's a good one. Also, welcome back. I think. Jade, are you back? Welcome back in spirit. Hello. Hello. Yeah. 
Okay. Man. This is a uh, braid. <laughs> Come on, braid. Braid brass name. Braid brass name. Braid brass braid. From Scandinavia. From braid the braid man. Braid. How are you? <laughs> How are you? <laughs> Very good. good. Bring them inside, even. <laughs> That's time. dangerous. Not for me. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So now that we've reclaimed the jade, yeah. Brain, brain talk at Zanzibar. Be like, hey Zanzibar, can you let us in? What do you mean, let you in? Is he not even looking up from the from what he's uh, doing? Look up. <laughs> And Zanzibar looks up to see what I imagine to be, as described, a poofy Samson and a beet red Hyala. I said it the other way around. <laughs> although, although. Oh, wait! Yeah! My words! Yeah. I wixed uh, my words up! <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> Oh no, the soul transfer has been complete! <laughs> oh, okay, 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 okay. So, yeah, no. He kind of just gets up, clears the table in front of the window. You just, you hear him say, because, you know, he doesn't just start talking at you. He continues the brain talk thing. But you actually see his lips moving on the other side of the window. You know, I half expected that you were just going to ask me before climbing down the rope. And you see him kind of, like, reach up for a few things on the lever. And instead, instead of opening down and outwards, it instead opens out from the top. And you just see that some hinges come out to hold the window like a ramp. And then you hear him talking normally. I didn't Doesn't expect you know. two to just decide. And he reaches up for the underside of the roof where the stones are and pull, grabs onto a small handle. That you really would not notice unless you knew it was there. That you wouldn't just be hanging hundreds of feet in the air. Click. And then a bunch of stones start to descend out from the underside of the ceiling like a big stone contraption forming a staircase that conjoins to the end of the window. Hundreds of feet in the air and then ask me to open the window. The later it gets, the less common sense this group has. You know, Both. Kel's just gonna be like, I didn't assume you'd closed it in the first place. I'm with her on that one. <laughs> well, I figured I had mentioned to you that there was a way to get up there without climbing, and I know that roof's not that steep, so I wasn't worrying about you falling over. And, to be fair, I actually did not notice the rope. So, I figured you bear climbed it. You know? He kind of just... What? He kind of just flexes his fingers like claws. You know, like how you usually climb a sheer face. Did not know you had a rope contrap... I, I'm guessing I'm going to have to go up there and untie that. I mean, we got no, it we down. Have... We, yeah, we can bring it down. I thought we did. Oh, yeah. Like, that was a whole conversation that was had. Well, you couldn't have been hanging in front of the window while holding onto the rope. Or holding onto the wall. <laughs> yeah, just like the ledge going wee. Oh, I guess while you were disconnecting, he was telling me that you were both like, hanging onto the rope like you were a bell clapper. But we could released it from the top, so that would have been bad. I guess I missed that part. And I guess he did too, because he was <laughs> describing well, no. swinging on the rope into the window to get Zanzibar's attention. To which I had to remind him a second time that you have a mental mind link with the man. Well, because when we described taking the rope down, you 
you, you said as if it was we were climbing the rope down. I was like, well, you're you're the you're the head honcho. Oh, cause you said taking the rope. I I heard taking the rope as taking the rope, like a rope. Oh yeah, cause I'm, yeah. I meant taking the rope down, yeah. which would also not. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't clear also, anything up. It's ambiguous. Yeah, it would make <laughs> things ambiguous. Yeah, English. Yeah. English is a fun language. Because Simpson was even like, oh, we don't. The thing he said after that is his justification was like, oh, we don't need it in the future. There's a thingy. So, yeah. I, so I that's what I, I heard. It's like, oh, we don't need it in the future, so we may as well pull it down off of the spire now. Yeah, you're, you're, you're hanging off the edge of the roof, staring at the window. <laughs> Just, uh, Samson, what are you doing? Uh, you know, hanging out. Hanging out. And then Zanzibar, like, opens the window so that it smacks us. <laughs> Bonk. No puns. But, yeah, no, a, a stone stairway comes off the tower and meets with the window. And ends up level with the roof. There are no guardrails. Watch your step. I like the idea that this set of stairs is somehow more dangerous than sheer climbing this thousand foot building. <laughs> it's not more dangerous. I mean, just, you know, watch that. Zanzibar built it, so. Are these stairs OSHA certified? <laughs> you know they're not. Uh, well, Hyala, Hyala has her certification, so we can. Yeah, we can so Hyala inspect it. All right, Hyala performs an OSHA inspection. Uh, but yeah, I'm guessing they end up inside? Yes, I would say so. Yeah. Mm. Get off the table. And Zanzibar will turn the mechanism back off and it'll go back to being as it were. You, you, you said mechanism, but my brain, like, hogged at when you were about to say Zanzibar turns the mecha, and I'm like, oh! <laughs> if, like, by endgame this tower doesn't turn into a giant fighting robot... <laughs> then what's the point? <laughs> With the pointy hat. <laughs> no, I realize the spire is so sharp and pointy, because that's the lance. Oh. Hella, Hella will look at Zanzibar and be like, Did Nim finish all of her training? Yep, and then she went to bed. And I figured I'd yeah. her. She was tired. Was it... Oh, it's yeah, certainly... the last part of her training was I told her to go full force. <laughs> 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 it's not intentional, I swear! The last. The last part of her training, I told her to go full force and just lay into me. You know, I wanted to see just how much damage she could deal. It was loud. She called me a punk. Is that what that was? Yes. She's quite the little destroyer. I rolled like shit? That's such a lie. <laughs> <laughs> I've given you the benefit of the doubt. Shut up. No! It was so consistently bad! All of my big damaging AoE spells did no damage onto one person. I legitimately have level 1 spells that could do more than that. Could! <laughs> That's if you fun. could roll for it! <laughs> exactly! This yeah. was the damage I would do if I could roll for it. <laughs> so, I, your statement- I have a crossbow that could do as much damage as yours, what's your point? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your level one spells could roll more damage than you rolled, but it's you rolling. So those low-level spells would probably roll even worse. Take what you can get. But yeah, no. He gives Yala the, the lowdown on him being 
she's done with her training for now. Woo. So as far as I know, you crawled up onto my roof to uh, investigate fireworks, but uh... And he kind of like looks out at the horizon. You've been up there for a few hours? What exactly did you find so interesting on my roof? Each other. Yeah, <laughs> duh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Kella's gonna be like, it's peaceful up there. Nim's not there. <laughs> More so than in here. <laughs> you know, fair enough. There is a reason why there is a staircase that goes up to the roof. Because I'm a lonely old man. And it would be a great place for firework. You certainly would get them high into the sky if you were launching them from the roof. Oh, uh, no, I was figured we just launch them from the ground and look at them from the roof. Zanzibar kind of just puts finger to chin. Hmm. That could work. If we're going to be leaving soon, would that need to be tomorrow night? As far as my count, we've covered Katna. Then there's Glotnia and Varisis to take care of. And from there, well, I guess we're going to just have to see how the headmasters respond and plan accordingly. All goes well, we'll have three instances of allies that could help shift the tides in our favor. And then, maybe see friend? Potentially. I don't know what's going on with Av Everingal or Averndal proper. I thought you were staying asleep. Snowdrop says something about fireworks. And travel. And then them face plants in the yellow shoulder. Kill it kind of like lifts her up from the shoulders. How's it going? Um, Good morning, ma'am. Good night, afternoon. Whichever applies. One of those apply. Um, it's still the evening. Morphe natting. I thought you were saying Morbius for a second. <laughs> Is uh, Kel still fluffy? Is Samson still red? Uh, yes. And then Samson walks over to Nim and screams Morbius sweep and then kicks her legs out. <laughs> <laughs> I really do have to watch this movie, don't I? No. <laughs> I mean, we haven't. <laughs> yeah. What the hell? <laughs> what is this slander? Uh, How could this movie be this popular if nobody's watched it? That's what makes it so funny. <laughs> that's what makes it so fucking funny. <laughs> a small handful of people watched it, said it was bad, some guy made a meme, and now everyone knows this movie exclusively by that meme. Or similar memes. <laughs> yes. More related memes. People thought like people went into it thinking that he actually says it's Morbin time. <laughs> <Does> it? <laughs> what do you mean? No. He doesn't. Although, uh, no! it sounds like a sequel has been greenlit. <laughs> yeah, I think a sequel has been greenlit. <laughs> Which means if they don't include it in the sequel, they did. They should just go out of business permanently. 
Yes. That's my take. Go out of business permanently. <laughs> if he cannot give us its morbid time, we don't want anything. If, we, if he doesn't morb, then what's <laughs> the point? Yeah. If he isn't straight morbid. Straight out of morbid. And Tanzawar will be fitting, sitting up, uh, standing there thinking to himself. And I suppose it's about Four. time to start considering what the first move of the war should be. But, but I guess to answer Nim's question, yeah, she probably still sees a red Samson and Puffy Hella. Okay, put that on the back burner. <laughs> Nim's like, I'm too tired to deal with this now. <laughs> yeah, I'm too tired to deal with you horny freaks. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, continue. Don't let me interrupt. I'm. Is 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 Kel still holding them up? <laughs> uh, she's she's like giving her support. So if it seems like Nim can stand on her own again, no, Nim can let... fully stand. She's just half asleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kel is trying to prevent her from flopping onto the floor. Is she like in that like state where she's like constantly rocking on her heels, about to fall over? No, not that tired. So what's the agenda? Uh, we're going to see Morby. <laughs> oh, I heard that movie's, I think the word's Pog? <laughs> that sounds about right. Yeah. Simpsons Boomers don't like it, it, though. So Actual I don't think Zanzibar will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, then you won't like it either, because you're a baby boomer. I'm not a baby boomer, that's my father. Mm, your father has powerful magic that explodes? <laughs> uh, Nim's talking about the literal definition. The magic of money. <laughs> the literal <laughs> definition yes. that doesn't exist in the TOZ universe? Oh, thank yeah, you. Yeah, because we're talking about Morbius in the actual <laughs> one as well. No, we're not. It's a diatribe, clearly. Or not a diatribe. Uh, yeah, that's my point. You. Morb. So, actual conversation. Go! <laughs> what? So, I have a question. If we're successful in getting, uh, well, our headmasters on board, there's a chance we won't be considered criminals in our home countries, right? That is my going plan! The idea was to first create criminals that are counter to the message they send out, and then to undermine the structure of society from the inside, creating doubt and suspicion, and then split the northern quarter into two neat little halves, one that is illogically bending the knee to the righteous and self-imposed just, and the gods, and the sane people who don't want to live under an absolutely oppressive ideology of I am a god, therefore you should bow and worship me. With the end result basically being the deicide of the entire current pantheon. Replacement pending. And with that, you get to retire. <laughs> retire? No. My work is never done. But at the very least, that should theoretically put an end to the constant and incessant every few hundred, couple thousand year voyage or conquest that seeks to ride up on my shores and get rid of Zanzibar the evil, Zanzibar the boogeyman, Zanzibar the five-headed serpent that spits poison and defecates lightning. You know, at a Samson certain point, slowly then... raises his hand. <laughs> yes, Samson. Can you actually do that? Are you dead ass right now? Like, like he lifts up. <laughs> Are his you being dead ass right now? <laughs> he lifts up his finger like he's about to scold Samson. He's like. Ah. 
Well, I don't have more than one head. And me you know of. Um. No. I suppose I could polymorph myself, but what would be the point? Imagine polymorphing. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> As for the spitting poison, yes. As for the defecating lightning, I feel that would be more uncomfortable than actually useful. So, we got a no, a yes, and a maybe. I suppose. So that's a solid 50% correct. <laughs> However, the ability to spit poison, defecate lightning, having multiple heads, and pretty much anything else I mentioned isn't exactly a reason to send countless numbers of young men and women dutifully brainwashed into serving the ideology of some powerful entity to their deaths. I mean, at some point, the shoreline's going to be filled with too many boats, and then what am I going to have to do? Go out there and clean out the shipwrecks by hand. You know, a I'm couple sure shipwrecks. You hire someone to do that. Who am I going to hire that's going to want? To... Oh yeah, there is a pirate ship that would be very willing to salvage scuttled wrecks. Why am I entertaining this conversation? You're sidetracking me. There's a war to be fought, and when it's done. The world will have peace. World well, peace. Or at least some semblance of peace until they start fighting amongst themselves and starting the next bout of wars. It is kind of just the nature of society. Don't think well, about it too much. Well, we still gotta play our part. Yes, I believe the common theme that they place on those posters to drum up enthusiasm would be uh, something to the effect of Do your part! Serve your duty! Poop out lightning! <laughs> Crap lightning and shit thunder! <laughs> Oh, oh my god. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's that's his spiel. I so badly wanted to throw in the line service guarantees citizenship. <laughs> <laughs> are you laughing because you get the reference, or are you laughing because it's funny? Because it's fun. Yeah, I don't expect anybody here to get the reference. I want to say it sounds familiar, but I guarantee nothing. Because <laughs> it's from Starship Troopers. I knew something. I knew it sounded familiar. Yeah, in any of the comedy bits about the dystopian propaganda, there's usually a thing that's like, and remember, service guarantees citizenship. Would you like to know more? No. Because they break up the movies with um, newsreels and propagandas from the Federation. And one of the things is your guaranteed citizenship if you serve in the um, army, or if any one of any one of the divisions. Anyway, my love for Starship Troopers aside, anything else to be said? Any final notes? Hmm. 
Oh, before we go. Before we go, before we go where? We gotta finish that ladder. Did you finish the ladder? <laughs> Did you finish those ladders? Man, Samson is just being a homie for Nim. Yeah, I appreciate it. But Nim's also like half asleep. <laughs> yeah. Never around to appreciate it. No, Nim's around, just not mentally. Sometimes not physically either. She'll go to sleep at the worst times. Yeah. And I will continue to complain, but actively encourage it. See, what I you just gotta you do will. is you just gotta astral project in your dreams, and then you can go to sleep every time, but still be around. <laughs> so there's still a ladder to be carved, and that's it. And fireworks and a party. And yeah. ice cream. The Zanzibar is already getting the fireworks, or helping to procure them. The party's on you three, and Nim's ice cream is on Shay to drum up so that I know what Zanzibar has to remember to get. Oh. Keep it within reason, of course. Like, no, no bathroom tub-sized amounts of ice cream. No swimming pools of five flavors. And get some fireworks. <laughs> no ice cream that gives her a permanent boost to intelligence and wisdom. No, that's the candy gummy pops I was gonna ask about, but that's a side tangent. Oh, good. You wanna ask about them now so I can say no? Nah, no. like I said, side tangent. Okay. What about ice cream that increases dexterity? No. <laughs> <laughs> Samson's going to look like around at like Yala, Nim, then Zanzibar and Burris. Is there anyone else waking in that? I almost said like really really rude your mom. <laughs> 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 you can just be like, cool, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can she make it here without dying? Sam Samson shoots the window and throws Nim out of it. You know who else can be playing your birthday part. party? Your mom! He likes his mom. You do? Oh, now I'm imagining muscle, muscle girl Nim, and I don't like it. <laughs> muscle ma'am? Muscle <laughs> Yo, bro! You hit me in my bun! <laughs> it's so cursed! That was strangely spot on. <laughs> Woo. How could you do this, bro? You took away all my ice cream! <laughs> oh god. Muscle Man is arguably the best worst thing to come out of that show. Pops is the best thing to come out of that show. Mm -hmm. That's no why I cat. said best worst thing. So is that a good place to end off? Yeah. For the third time, any final final notes? Nim, uh, sounds like we're gonna continue this next time, so Nim will not go back to bed. I I mean, I don't know if there's anything left to do in the day besides just eat dinner and vibe. Oh, I didn't know if you guys were gonna continue to talk about, like, the plan for, like, when everyone heads off. As that Probably actually does have to be spoken about. Probably tomorrow. Yeah. That, that... Yeah. But yeah, goodbye, everybody! Goodbye. Goodbye. What are you still doing here, you freaks? Get the fuck out. <laughs> yeah.